Hi friends, hope you all fine. In this video, I am going to demonstrate the working flow of a Kabali software, an Uber-like application built by us for a ride hailing companies. This demo would be a lengthy one, hence I would like to start booking oriented module. Later, we can proceed with other modules. For this demo, I have displayed two driver mobile from economic category and one rider mobile in front of you. Rider need to select the pickup and drop location to view the estimated price of each cap type and their availability. In our Kabli Enterprise version, we integrated with more than 30 payment gateways all over the world like PayPal, Stripe, WorldPay, Paytm, PayU, etc. Now I am going to add a new driver mobile in different category to show how the on-demand availability works. Since it is an on-demand process, user or rider can book a ride only when the driver is in online. In this example, you can see when a driver turns offline, it shows no cabs available nearby. If it is an online, it will show the estimated time, arrival time and the pricing. Now I am going to explain the complete booking flow. Once rider confirmed the booking, the request will go to the nearby drivers based on the algorithm configured in Adbin. Either it is a nearby drivers or bulk or the queue based. Once driver accepted the booking, the rider will get notified with the booking information and driver details. Once booking is confirmed, rider can communicate with the driver through call option and chat. For calling, we implemented Twilio phone masking. For chat, we implemented an in-app chat feature which helps rider to chat with the driver rather than exchanging a creepy text with the drivers. In our Kabali software, we implemented geofencing technology to improve the interaction between the drivers and the rider. It is no longer necessary to relay on the manual confirmation when the driver arrive or leave the pickup area. Instead, the rider will get an automatic alert when the driver's arrival and can reference the real location in the real time on the map. That can be initiated by both driver as well as users. Once the trip is started, rider can't cancel or chat with the driver. As you see in the screen, there are only two options is available. One is Spitfire and Share ETA option. You can view the real-time location of the vehicle when you are on board and access the driver route maps and driver behavior when on the move. We explained about the splitware functionality in detail in a separate video. Next feature is a shared ETA, which means sharing your estimated time of arrival with your friends or family once you take a ride. In shared ETA, you will have an option to share your trip details with your loved ones via social networks or SMS, email, etc. Once you click and enter the phone numbers or sharing the link, they will get a message with a link. Opening the link displays your driver name, vehicle info and your map location in real time.
the mode of the payment must be chosen by the rider before booking the ride either it is a credit card or cash or wallet once the payment is success rider have an option to share the tip from the app that tip amount go directly to the drivers no commission or service fee on the tips riders can view their trip summary and transaction details in the app at any point of time this video gives you the complete booking flow of our uber like application